From News 5, here's your Power of 5 weather and today's top stories, sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. Hi there, everyone. Power 5 meteorologist Brian Shaw here. Mostly sunny skies for today. Temperatures in the mid-50s, very similar to what we had yesterday. Get outside and enjoy it while you can. Temperatures drop down into the low 30s once again for tonight. We'll start to see a few more clouds across northeast Ohio. The warming trend is going to continue all the way through Christmas. Terrence Lee here with a look at your top stories on this Christmas Eve Eve. Cleveland firefighters are investigating a deadly house fire on the city's west side. It started just after 9 this morning on Doris Avenue. One woman was injured after she jumped out of a second, second story window. A second person died on scene. Crews say they had to fight through a large amount of clutter, which made that rescue effort a little bit more difficult. This afternoon, a group of people will be protesting here outside Cleveland City Hall. They're demanding help from uh, help with a plan from city officials to fix a cold weather shelter for the homeless. Code violations that put that shelter at risk of shutting down. Canton is installing new technology to help police pinpoint where crimes are happening and who's responsible. This new system includes gunshot detectors, license plate readers and cameras connected to Wi-Fi. We'll have another update for you later tonight. Until then, check the News 5 app for the latest stories. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.